All right, guys, we are going on an amazing adventure. Yeah! Yes, we're going camping. Yeah! Are you guys ready? We yeah! are going yeah! camping on the trampoline. <laughs> so, we're gonna spend 24 hours on the trampoline. Go get yourself a backpack, fill it with food, something to sleep with, five some things. type of a toy you have. Only can bring five things. Put it in your backpack and let's meet out on the trampoline. You ready? Okay, this will be fun. Okay, let's go. <laughs> what do you have? A backpack. Let me see. Cool. Time to fill it up. Yeah. Go put some stuff in it. <laughs> Okay, we're in here for 24 hours. It's just after breakfast. Redberries. Oh, Corbin brought some breakfast cereal. Smart. And a Ziploc bag too, wow. For, for lunch, tortilla chips. Oh, wow. And for dinner, this might be funny. Applesauce. Oh, nice. Is that all you brought? No, I have more stuff. A book to read. Oh, nice. Food, a book. And Morse code. Oh, what is that? Oh, spy gear. Cool. Good thinking, dude. Very prepared. I'm actually really surprised at Corbin's like thought. He, everything he brought was very well thought out. And even prepared. It's even in like Ziploc bags and everything. I got two, I got two uh -oh. toys and three meals. What about, did you bring a pillow or a blanket? Uh oh. What about if we need to go to the bathroom? See, that's the thing that I said, uh, uh oh, about because I realized we have a little tiny toilet we could have brought in. <laughs> well, I think that if anybody has to go potty, then they're allowed to leave if they have to go potty. But that's the only exception. What did you bring? A blanket. A blanket? She brought a blanket. Corporal for She's got a big bag. Oh, she just got the whole thing. Yeah. Who needs Ziploc? What? You brought salsa? Medium salsa? Oh, Becca's taking her kids' packing space. <laughs> well, food, food, food. Oh, oh, apple's getting away. And an apple. Another apple? Is that your five things? Two apples, sauce, apple. chips, and blanket? <laughs> Let's see. No, no. How many apples did you bring? A whole bag of apples. <laughs> You're just grabbing the same apple over and over again. What is that? Make a makeup bag. Is that makeup? I'll show you what's inside it. Okay. Um, oh wow, she does have a hundred apples. Some toys, and I'll show you what's up. Might have gotten a few more than five things. And this. We'll and just toys. have to share with everyone. All right. Well, always very prepared. And this. Cool, awesome. All right, well, since this is actually yours, I'm gonna let you keep track of it. What else do you have? Pass me the chips. Pass my other chips. You brought a whole stash of toys. Three dolls. And I've got nine. So, a bunch of toys. And... <laughs> no, chapstick, no, no, chapstick. Chapstick. Mm -hmm. There's the chapstick, I'm looking all over for that. Oh, you're it's gonna have... You. All right, James, what did you bring? Okay. I got a, a no, pillow, a crackers. sleeping bag, and applesauce. Mm -hmm. Graham, crackers. Graham crackers. Anything else? I brought a bagel, but mom put it in the bag because she got You didn't bring any toys or anything else? No, because I have the trampoline to have fun on. <laughs> this is a built-in no, toy. No, no having fun! <laughs> hey, Ellie, you gotta get control of all your apples, girl. They all ran away. <laughs> There Apples you go. can't run away. <laughs> they so. roll run away. I think we're ready to hear what Mama brought. So I guess lunchtime wait, wait. couldn't wait. It's tasty. It's tasty. <laughs> I put a lot of salsa on this chip. What That's did so you bring, dear? Okay, so I packed. Because right now you're eating Ellie's chips and Ellie's salsa. Yeah. I know. 
<laughs> Did you even bring anything for yourself? Oh, I need Charlie's backpack. I put something in his bag. <laughs> she's making fun of Ellie for bringing too much stuff, but yeah. she just packed all of her stuff Thank in you, Ellie Charlie. and Charlie's bag. I packed Charlie's bag for him because I knew he wasn't going to grab stuff that we needed, like water. I need 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 water. See what I mean? I need water. I need water. I need water. Patience. Then, I was thinking, this is the most important thing. If we're out here all day long, we're probably gonna start getting sunburned. So I decided to bring, or if, if it starts raining, we gotta be prepared, so I brought an umbrella. Oh yeah, it looks like nice. it's gonna start to rain soon. Did you bring anything else? Yes, I brought this, cause I really like, uh, I wanna try it. It could rain. Flavored water. And I brought bagels, it's very filling. Oh. And I brought my phone, cause I would probably get bored. We watch movies. Whatever. Ah. And I got two sleeping bags. I didn't get any pillows, but I got two sleeping bags so that if it gets cold through the night, we'll be good. What if someone knocks on our front door? We won't know. I guess we'll be ready. Now it's my turn. You guys want to see what I brought? I brought the best stuff. Here. I packed also water because I. Hey! Hey, I'm finding all my water bottles now. Those are my favorite water bottles, by the way. Get them at Walmart. Okay. I also brought a toothbrush. Oh, good. Like stank breath. Stank breath. Now I have salsa breath, and I'm gonna have to live with that for 24 hours. And I brought a game. <gasps> kids know best. Oh. It's parents versus kids trivia game. I thought cool. it might be kind of fun later on if we want something. Fun okay. To cool. And I also brought a pillow. Wow, that fit in there. So I wanted to have my pillow and I'll just share a blanket with somebody. Okay. And last but not least, almonds. Oh, Smoke good. I don't even think those are ours. I'm pretty sure they're my mom's. She left them out. <laughs> hey. <laughs> That's <laughs> We can share a pillow. I don't have a pillow. Here, do you want to put this in with the food stash? The kitchen? Yeah. That's all I brought. Okay. I need to eat some of my red berries. So. Don't eat all your food at once. We ha we still have 24 hours here. We gotta be really careful not to eat everything in one hour. That's all the food we have for whole a whole 24 hours. I have water bottles. Water bottles. I think I'm gonna start out this 24 hours Yay. with a nap. Yay. Okay. I think if the kids are jumping on the trampoline, you won't be able to take a nap. <laughs> All right, Ellie and Dad are sleeping. So we're the perfect pair because I brought a pillow and no blanket, and she brought a blanket and no pillow. <laughs> yeah. James has got a blanket and pillow. Corbin's got his blanket. I guess I'll be sharing mine with Charlie, which is not hard because he's tiny, huh? While everybody else is taking a nap, I'm gonna crack open my peach water. Finished off all your soda. Why are you throwing that out there? That's littering. I'll clean it up later. I don't want to live on it. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Everyone's just been eating chips and salsa. We also have bagels for dinner. Anyone Guys, dinner? I think that we should play Kids Know Best. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys want to play that right now? Yeah. Okay. So I've got the trivia cards right here in my pocket. So basically the way that it works is we ask the kids questions and they have to see if they can answer it. And then the kids ask the adults questions and whoever gets the most right answers wins. Okay, I think we should line up all the kids and us sitting next to each other. Uh-oh, I got a rash in the water. Hi. Unless it rains, then we can open this up and catch water. <laughs> it could. No, It's I pretty cloudy out here. It is pretty cloudy actually, so. All right. Hopefully it doesn't rain, because that would be bad. All right, I'm gonna have- Charlie is on our team, I guess. Me and Michael's team, or he's at least sitting he's by us. He's our mascot. He's our mascot. So here's the questions. They've got questions for parents, and they've got questions for kids. So I'm gonna hand these Corbin, to Corbin. So he's gonna ask us the questions, and then I'm gonna ask the kids the questions, and we get to answer as a team, and they're gonna answer as a team. So okay. Corbin, ask the first question to parents, but don't say the answer. What mountain range includes Mount Everest? <gasps> Is it the Himalayas. The Himalayas? Himalayas. Yeah. Really? Hey, good job. <laughs> So I'm gonna give this card to you. That's how we keep track of how many you got it's right. Fine. I wanna think. Boop, 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 boop. I've got a question for the kids. What iconic structure is the tallest 
structure in Paris, built for the 1889 World Fair. The Eiffel Tower. Whoa! <laughs> I was about to say that one. I'm surprised. <laughs> I was like, they're not gonna guess this. They don't know. Well, how did you know that, James? Because that's the tallest one. <laughs> No. Did you guys know that I've been to the Eiffel Tower? No. When I was Charlie's age. No. Yep. No way. Yeah, I went there when I was a little baby. No way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Corbin, your turn to ask a question. What are the hurricanes called in the southern hemisphere? What are the hurricanes called? Tsunamis. In the southern hemisphere. No. Uh, I don't know, dude. What is it? Cyclones. Oh. Oh, really? Wait, so they call hurricanes cyclones in the south of the equator? Is that true? Are any of you guys south of the equator? And is that true? Do they call them cyclones instead of hurricanes? That is so weird. Because I've never heard of that before. Cool. <laughs> A wave landed on your head. What? <laughs> I actually, okay, I know. I actually felt it and I was like, please don't be a bug. Please don't be a bug or bird poop or something like that. <laughs> Eh, you of leaf. Get it off the can't believe. <laughs> so we lost that turn. Now it's my turn to read to the kids. Okay. Who wrote Green Eggs and Ham? <gasps> I know this one. Who wrote the book Green Eggs and Ham? We don't know that. Dr. Hips. Oh, yeah. Wow. Her. That's okay. I got it right! Yes! <laughs> okay, I want to read one. You can read the next one. It's Corbin's turn. Oh, okay. okay. What legendary creature is also known as the abominable snowman? A yeti. The yeti? <laughs> a yeti. The yeti. yeti. The <laughs> All right, we got a point. We got oh, wait. a point. Do I get to read one? What animal eats only eucalyptus leaves? Dinosaurs. Okay, say that again. What animal only eats eucalyptus leaves? Eucalyptus. Um, we've, se we've seen one before in a zoo. I don't think they're gonna get it. Gorilla. No, eh, eh, wrong. Koala. Koala. What country is famous for making camembert cheese? What, how is it spelled? Do you guys know the answer to that? Maybe you're from this country. Camembert it's cheese. Right France. Yeah! Hey! Good oh, guess! Oh, which, which country's the cheesiest? <laughs> exactly France. <laughs> okay, and that's not an insult, it's oh, just that no, lots of cheese it, comes yeah. from there. Okay. okay. What are the three colors on the American flag? Blue. Blue, red, and white. That's right! Good job! All right, how many cards do you guys have? Three. Okay, we have three cards also. So, I win. So we're gonna play till the next person that gets four cards. So if we get four on this one, then you get another chance. But if you lose, then we win. But if you win, then we keep going until someone loses. Okay? Sudden death round starts now. Okay, read it. Yep, go ahead and read it, Corbin. What is a crack? In an ice flow or a glacier cold. Say that again. What is a crack in a what? What is a crack in an ice flow or a glacier cold? A crack in an ice flow a or a glacier. I don't know this one. Do you guys know this one? Uh, I do. <laughs> of course you That's because you read the answer. <laughs> oh, why? I feel like I have something right on the tip of my tongue. I don't know. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. Uh, crevice. Yeah! What? No way! <laughs> You're round. kidding me! Let me see it. It's not over yet. You guys have a chance. What the heck? <laughs> a crevice? Seriously? Wow. Becca. I couldn't even remember it for a really long time. You are way smarter than I thought you were. <laughs> That's a compliment. I an insult at the same time. <laughs> All right. Time to ask the kids. Are you guys ready for this question? Okay, here it is. How many stripes are on the American flag? Um, oh, that's hard. Eight, seven, ten. 
Is that too hard, you guys? Yeah, that's too hard. Is that too hard? Okay, I'll ask another one. I there's three. There's three kid questions on one card. I'm gonna ask all three of them, and if they don't get any of them right, tough luck. We win. We win. Okay. What's the title of America's national anthem? Nope. Dragon World. <laughs> Dragon World. <laughs> Dragon World. I don't know what that means. That can okay, then we have some teaching to do. Yeah, we do. They don't know that. That's our fault. <gasps> it's the Star Spangled Banner. That's funny. I was going to say America the Beautiful, even though I know I'm like, oh, of course that's what it is. And there are 13 stripes on the American flag. Ready for the last question? This is your last chance. Sudden death. What date is Valentine's I'm Day? I'm going to get this. The 24th of uh, February. Close, very close. Wait, it's wait, 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 wait. Let James guess because he has a birthday close to it. That's right. James, what day is Valentine's Day? Just say a date. A date. <gasps> oh no, guys! Did you guys hear that? No joke. Thunder. At least oh. we're prepared. <laughs> All right, everybody listen up. We're gonna give the kids another chance, just so they can win, you know. We've already won as adults, we're smarter and that's okay. <laughs> but we wanna give them a chance to redeem themselves. What are the four seasons? Uh, Christmas. <laughs> summer. Okay. Fall. Okay. Mom. And spring. That's three. Winter. Yay! Ah, Good job. <gasps> uh oh. It's raining. Ah, I just got wet. Charlie's hungry. I'm going to open up some food and then let's all hide underneath the, the it's umbrella. Rain. Okay. Ah! I'm feeling raindrops starting to get wet. Okay, time to hide underneath the umbrella with everybody. This is going to be interesting with this many people. I'm trying to put the sleeping bags under. Look at this. This is what we've got going on. So we've got sleeping bags, Charlie, Ellie, James, Corbin, all of our backpacks and everything. And Michael's using the bathroom, so he'll be right back. I can't believe it's starting to rain. This is like worst case scenario. Actually, you know what? Worst case scenario would probably be cats and dogs falling from the sky or no. it suddenly turns to winter and 10 feet of snow fall on our head. That would probably be worse actually, so. It's getting worse. Hey, you gotta, look, Corbin's just hiding underneath the sleeping bag away from the rain. Look, you can see all of the raindrops on the trampoline. Oh man, this is bad. Get underneath, oh, out of the my, weather. Off of my sleeping bag. Hey, on that side, there's a little bit of shade from the trees that might help you to not get as much raindrops on you, so. Michael, are you gonna come hide underneath the umbrella now? I'm coming, I'm coming. Save some space for me. Okay. <laughs> no. All of the kids are just underneath their blankets and sleeping bags trying to get out of the rain. But this 24 hours on a trampoline is turning dangerous. out to be a disaster. <laughs> or really fun, one or the other, we can't tell. Definitely an adventure, that's for sure. <laughs> Look, Charlie, okay, Ellie's trying to be protected. Corbin is underneath the tree, so he's good. He's not getting wet. James is underneath his sleeping bag. He's getting a little bit wet, but Charlie's underneath. He's literally sitting on my lap, just hiding. <laughs> we should wait out this storm. All right. We'll, we'll check back. Wait. We'll check back with you once the rain stops. Yep. It's starting to get really late. We've been on the trampoline for hours and hours. I don't even know what time. It, what time is it? It's almost uh, dinner time. It's almost dinner time. No, we already had dinner. No, you had lunch. You had a bunch of snacks too. Oh, okay. Soon we'll have dinner, and then it will be get, and then it will be time to get ready for bed. Let's just wait out this storm, and hopefully we don't get too soaking wet. <laughs> that would be terrible if we got soaking wet, and then we had to sleep in it. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Charlie, do that again. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a spin, twist, fall, faint. So this is the talk show, <laughs> of the evening. <laughs> we see talk show, portion of the evening. We're getting a little restless here. Okay, pull out the chips. We're gonna have chips. We're gonna have bagels. Can I have a bagel? I'm getting really hungry. Chips! Yes, we can have a bagel. Here's some chips. Everybody can, can eat. I have some chips? I'm really hungry. Yes, here's a bagel. Who wants a bagel, can Michael? I want one. Ready, Thank set. You. There you go. I want water. Water bottle. 
I guess once we're all done eating, then it's time to just let the kids get the wiggles out. And then it's time to go to bed on the trampoline. This is gonna be so much fun. I remember sleeping out on the trampoline when I was a kid. And it was actually scary because I didn't know, I, it occurred to me for the first time ever that a, a wild animal or a bear or a bad guy could sneak. Ah, a huge raindrop just hit me right in the eye. Anyways, I know. A wild animal or a wild person could go in the backyard and attack me in the middle of the night and I got so scared. Hey, you know what? You don't have to be afraid because we've got a zipper and no bad guys can get past that zipper. I know. No, I was I... just thinking about how if I was a kid nowadays, they didn't even have these when I was a kid. I know, me neither. And I broke my arm because of it. <laughs> and you are but with this net, I feel so much more safe, especially with all the kids. Everybody will be fine tonight with the net. But without the net? Especially without animals. Yeah. Animals won't be able to get past this net. There's a wild dog right there. Look. <gasps> wild dog. He looks ferocious. <laughs> It's a beautiful night. The sun is going down. It's getting dark out. You can barely even see anything out here. It's slowly slided by you. Yeah, everybody's sliding together in the middle of this trampoline. Ooh, watch this. So dark out here. She just slides into me every time. Yeah. Well, that's the thing that, uh, especially if you're a little kid and you want to sleep on the trampoline, I remember it just would. Everybody would slide into the middle of the trampoline if there was somebody bigger. Whoever's mm -hmm. the biggest. Jennifer would sleep out on the trampoline with me and I would always... And uh, squished next to her. Yeah, and I was like, ah, I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well folks, we're gonna go to sleep it's now. Time to start calming down, and everybody. And we'll see you in the morning, bright and early. Yeah. Good old fashioned trampoline wake up call. Oh, great. Good night. Good night. <laughs> wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. It's morning time, it's morning time. Is it still raining? raining. How did you guys sleep oh, last I night? <gasps> It's morning dew is what that wetness is that you're feeling. Oh. That's pretty normal I in the mornings. I just got morning dew on my eye to wake up. Good morning. How was your night? Terrible. <laughs> it's hard to sleep with everybody scooting towards you and squishing you. But actually, the, the cuddling the kids was. <laughs> yep, everybody's fighting over the blanket all night, but it was pretty good. It didn't get too cold either. Yeah. I'm happy it's morning time. Let's get some breakfast. Did anybody bring breakfast? Oh. I got some. I got some. I still have some bagels left over from dinner. You know my breakfast? Oh yeah, let's get those bagels out. Okay. My breakfast is red berries and applesauce. That's right. 24 hours has passed on the trampoline. And can I just say, there was a lot of ups and downs on this trampoline. <laughs> the rain. <laughs> That's you get my joke? I get your joke and it was a good one. More. Actually I was thinking, yeah there were, you know, kids being hungry and Ups cranky and, down. and squishing each other Ups. and it was rainy. I think everyone's had enough of this trampoline. Yeah. So I'm glad that 24 hours is over and we can finally get off of this bouncy bouncy machine. This took forever. <laughs> 24 hours is a long time. Alright, we had a fun 24 hours on the trampoline. It was a great time. But I'm so excited that it's over. Yes, seriously. <laughs> That's the only thing we need to do to end it 24 hours is to eat breakfast. So, yeah. tell us in the comments yeah. below what should we do or I where should have... we spend 24 hours in our next uh, 24 hour yeah. challenge video. I have and who do it with? Everybody or just a couple of us? That's right. Watch <laughs> the Becca and Ryan show. We have a new video up on there and it is hilarious. You I'll have a link it. in the description below. We love you guys and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Pause the Pause game. The game. Bye. Bye.